Hey, good morning, y'all. It's Anthony Mitchell. All right, so I just finished up my workout, my little meditation session. Now, some things crossed my mind while I was meditating that I wanted to share with everybody. Do you like the results you're getting in life? I mean, like, seriously, do you actually enjoy your life? Because you do realize how you feel is going to dictate the action that you're going to take, which in turn are going to bring about the results that you experience. So guess what? If you don't like the results you're getting, change your actions, change the way you feel about life, and thereby changing your feeling about life, you'll change the actions you take in life, and you'll start getting the results you want. I know it's um, psycho babble that most people don't believe in, but try it. <sighs> but, but besides that, y'all, if you don't like the way your body looks, wake up. Work out, get healthy, take some time to meditate, continue to grow daily. Like yesterday, I subscribed to uh, Amazon Kindle Unlimited thing. So I got unlimited access to audiobooks and Kindle books. So I started reading a little damn pina. I downloaded a few audiobooks. And oh, if you haven't looked at it, damn pina has a oh, well, 51 books for wealth. Uh, what you wish to read check them out they're actually pretty interesting i said if you want success in life find someone who's achieved the success you want and um follow their guidance if they don't work for you try somebody else like i bounced around i went from john or from grant cardone bob proctor earl nightingale napoleon hill uh ferris on uh, the four hour work week. Uh Tim Ferris was his name. Um Bedros. I don't know how you pronounce his name. He owns Fit Body Boot Camp. But find people and learn from them. Study them. Like me, when I'm riding around in my car, instead of listening to radio, I'm listening to audiobooks. Why? Because everything you want in this world is already here. Someone's already been through what you're going through. Someone's already overcame what you came to. Someone's already achieved what you want to achieve. So keep reading, keep learning, keep growing. It's not hard, but it takes a lot more effort than it does just to listen to some hip hop or rap and or watch Netflix and chill. That's like I've been doing a lot of reading the last couple of days. A lot of people have been talking about the fire movement, financial independence, retire early. Hey, it's a great concept. And I said I'm 32. By 35, technically, my plan is to be retired from working because I have to. I'll work because I want to. Because I absolutely love what I do. That's why I don't have a job. Because that's too much work that I really don't care to do. And I enjoy the freedom to work when I want and how I want. I said people make a hell of a lot more money than I do, but I don't care. The money I do make goes into my investments, goes into my retirement accounts, and it goes to pay down my debt. Because I made some dumb choices in my life, I accumulated some debt because of marriages, and putting stuff in my name, and it's no good. So my credit's kind of screwed, so I'm trying to work on building that up again. Uh, paying down my debt. Selling my house in Tennessee, which I already had an offer on, which that's a funny endeavor. I'm just waiting for the appraiser to come back from the VA to approve the short sale. Because they're saying I owe more money than I listed the house for. So I got to short sell the house, which I don't know why it's taking so long, but eh, that's out of my control, so I'm not going to worry about it. I focus on things I can control. And I have a pretty happy life. So y'all, have a great day. Subscribe. And for the love of God, do something you love. Have a great one, y'all.